Hey Pipers, Callan Doyle here. Thought I would uh, have an opportunity to do my first Yabo. And uh, like they say, timing is everything. So just sitting here and the dog kind of started making a fuss. So I ran out there to see and here's my box. And uh, <clears throat> great timing on this because the wife's not here. And uh, she's already been throwing that H word around that I I don't particularly care for. But uh, <clears throat> had to have an, I don't know if anybody else took advantage of the uh, sale that was going on. Pipes and cigars, 15% off of Lane and 15% off of Peter Stokeby. So I had to take advantage. So the first one we got here, nice little two-pound package of 1Q. I, uh, you know, when you buy 1Q, I think you can see 32 ounces. When you buy the 1Q, you can get it for $1.58 per ounce, which is a bargain. And I think with the 15% the off, it worked out to $1.38 an ounce. So just, you know, had to have that. Couldn't pass that up. Uh, a few other ones that I had to, to get was uh, this is the uh, Lane BCA uh, Black Cavendish Aromatic. Uh, seen quite a few people talk about it. Seen Henry Sims talk about it a lot here lately. So I uh, wanted to give that a shot as well. Let's keep looking. Got a few more things in here. Uh, this here is the Peter Stokopy Danks Black. And uh, I guess I want a kind of a black Cavendish kick. So I like the golden Cavendish. So uh, I said, you know, hey, might as well give this a shot too. Uh, went on ahead and... Uh, wanted to try some more of uh, Peter Stokeby's English blend, so uh, I think I got eight ounces here of proper English. I, uh, you could smell it all the way through when I picked up the box from outside. Boy, ooh, it smells good. Yeah, the Latakia are really prominent in this. So, another goodie. Here I, uh, Got the Peter Stokeby uh, Eng English Luxury blend. So, now I find this not quite coming through the uh, package, not as quite as strong a blend as the other, as the proper English. And more of a, I'll have to open them up and really get a good whiff of these. And then if they see the last thing that I went for was a little Peter Stokeby champagne and uh, th this is an aromatic that I really really like uh, I know I was talking earlier that uh, one of the things that I really like to do is um, is enjoy the aroma off the aromatics uh, and uh, that, that that champagne uh, it's it's a ribbon cut tobacco and it's both it's predominantly light Cavendish with some dark Cavendish mixed in, but man, it it smells excellent. But the aroma that comes off of the smoke of it is just outstanding. Uh, it is uh, wife and daughter approved. So just thought I'd share this with you. First time I had an opportunity to do a little yabo, and uh, I can actually get this tucked away into my tobacco cabinet for wife even knows about it. You know, I mean, timing is everything. So, guys, until we see you next time, keep them lit, keep them smoking.